Well, I built little three stick structures out of Y topped trimmed hedge pieces. And in the distance, and we'll take a closer look in a moment, I covered up my kiwi, my hardy kiwi, because it's in blossom and we're supposed to get across tonight. And um, I've got here a huge handful of just leaves. And this is for the peppers. The basic concept here is hopefully not knock it over, but I just somewhat did. There we go. So I'm just going to use these to put a little bit of additional insulation around my peppers. I'm sorry, that was probably a really, really rough screen. Um, <laughs> I probably should have warned you ahead of time, but I'm going to continue to go get more of those branches. I have them sorted by size here, and that's yoke height, not length, so that the yoke heights that matched are the ones that created these little structures. There's a smaller one there. And this is just to keep the branches then from crushing the plant against the bottle. The bottle would be enough if the peppers were down inside there, but it, they're not down inside there. So I'm gonna bring more branches over. And then here you get the general idea there's one branch sticking out here of hardy kiwi blossoms. Luckily, at least they're not open, but just finally got food off of this last year, so I don't want to lose it all. So that's covered in branches. There's a few more small branches there. And several more down there. Um, and a few more available if I decide to finish cutting yoke branches, but I think for the most part I'm just about ready here. Just wanted to show you what I was doing to finish um, protecting my plants from tonight's expected frost. And the storm is definitely rolling in. Now we're back by the Kiwi, so that's about where we are. Okay, bye!